local dudes seem to, I mean, they seem to get some pretty decent sized fish. How do those guys catch most of the, the long tail tuna? Yeah, the, the long tails, there's where we were in Chisa, the, um, the family, or this, our sort of a mining uh, sponsor, his, that's his family village uh, that comes from Shisa. Now, uh, a couple of them net, like if the, if the tuna come into the back of the fjords in one of the bays, then they'll, with a down on a boat, they'll net specifically for that shoal of tuna. But uh, what they normally do is they've got like a small, they use hand line, and they've got a small like metal jig. It's actually like an aluminium tube with two hooks coming out of the back and like a little tuft of green or red sort of uh, feather or you know, sort of uh, bucktail type material coming out the back and they, they pull that. Yeah, that was quite amazing. I was dying to see what they were using because you could see they pretty they gave a little bit of a flick and they threw that thing, spread all the line out on the deck and they threw that, that jig that they were throwing into the tuna a long way. And it was interesting to see what it was. It reminded me of a, a ballpoint squid that we used to make many, many years ago to catch bonnies and salad fish and that kind of thing. It was made out of the front of a ballpoint pen. This thing had the same kind of shape. It was like a, a tube with a bit of lead in it. It was silver, it had two red eyes and it had a, a double hook um, with a bit of a feather at the back and uh, the, the line was actually pushed through a hole and then a knot tied in the line on the other end to stop it coming back out again. So it obviously rode sort of head down in the water but very effective and they obviously also know that you've got to throw that into the fish when they're really getting the water into a froth and uh, I think if you throw pretty much anything into the water when it's frothing they're going to eat it. Uh, no, they're, they're awesome fishermen, but they've been doing it for generations, and we've tried those little uh, little jigs and that, and I mean, for us, it doesn't really work. Too.